Howard W. Hunter faced adversity with patience, long-suffering, and submission. As he remained faithful during personal and family challenges, his experience assisted him in the preparation needed to stand before the church as a prophet, seer, and revelator. For example, President Hunter was familiar with the challenges inherent in being raised in a part member family. He knew of the yearning for temple blessings, yet waited half his life for those blessings to become a reality. He was familiar with the challenges of lost employment and financial hardship. Having lost his first son in infancy, Howard W. Hunter identified with those who mourned the passing of a loved one. Having cared for his failing wife, Claire, for over 13 years, President Hunter knew of the struggles of old age and ill health. The adversities he faced in life taught him compassion, patience, love, and mercy. He's a man who's known much of suffering, and that has had a tempering influence upon his life. He's known much of personal sorrow, and in his problems with his health, he has walked through the valley of the shadow of death uh, on more than one occasion. He's a living miracle. Peace was on the lips and in the hearts and in the heart of the Savior, no matter how fiercely the tempest was raging, may it be so with us. In our own hearts, in our own homes, in our nations of the world and even in the buffetings faced from time to time by the church. We should not expect to get through life individually or collectively without some opposition. 